marriage supposed to make us happy? <laughs> um, I don't. I, I don't I think don't, it's supposed to make you miserable. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I think the question is a good question. Yeah. Um, um, biblically, is marriage supposed to make you happy? Marriage is going to make you holy. Um, uh, and in and in finding holiness, you'll find happiness. You'll find joy. Yes. You'll find joy. Um, uh, but, but again, ha- happy, happy is an emotion, which means it could change. That's right. Um, and so if you're getting married to find happiness, what happens when you wake up and you're not happy though? Yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I don't, I don't, I don't want to, I don't want to say marriage is supposed to make you happy. I, I, I say marriage is supposed to make you holy. And in you finding that holiness, and I'm not talking about like when I, when you hear holy, don't don't hear like, you know, I'm praying 24 hours a day, and 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 I know the whole Bible front to back. Uh, when when God says I want you to be holy as I am holy, He's not asking you to be like Him because you can't match His holiness, right? Our, our righteousness is as filthy rags, so that's not the comparison. What, what He's saying is I want you to be completely other as I am completely other. <laughs> right. And when two people really come together and, and become that picture of Christ and his, and his bride, they become completely other than, other than what they correct. were when they said, I do, uh, and exchange their vows. And so I say, shoot for holiness in your marriage. It will mean a lot of work and you will die, but you will be happy at the end of it. Yeah, and, I, and to, just to add to that too, um, and I want to make sure that I'm, uh, hopefully I'm understanding this question Biblically, is marriage supposed to make us happy? I think sometimes, too, there is a fulfillment that yeah. comes when you're with a spouse or when you're with a person. And this is why people get married. Sometimes they want to feel, I don't want to say fulfilled, but they want to partner. They want to do life with them. They yeah. want to share their life, which brings a sense of fulfillment and joy. Um, and in that fulfillment comes a happiness, comes good feelings, and it also comes negative feelings sometimes. For sure. Um, but there is a, um, a satisfaction being with somebody, and biblically, when it is done right, yeah. you, you should be happy. Yeah. You should feel fulfilled. You should feel joyful um, when it is done biblically. So I'm, lear- I'm learning Spanish right now, and um, uh, in Spanish, if I were to say I am happy, I would say estoy contento. Right? Estoy muy contento. Content, maybe, is the better word yeah. than happy. Yeah. I, I, I am content with Juliet. Mm-hmm. But on I'm the happy day, with you. On the days that I'm super happy and on the <laughs> days that I'm super frustrated, I'm, I've That's always right. been content. For sure. For sure. So At the very base. At the very base, the, I'm content. At the because very base, happiness content. Will, is fleeting. It is. And anger, anger is, is fleeting. fleeting. Right? right, being frustrated is is, is, is fleeting. It's so, fleeting. at I'm always content though. For sure. And Agreed. wherever the where, wherever I am on the spectrum, I'm still content. Uh, I'm 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 cool with because at, at the base of it, estoy muy contento. Yeah, come yeah. on, baby, say that again now. Estoy Ay. muy. Contento. Okay. <laughs> Stop it now. Oh!